2021, 76 years ago today, the Allied troops invaded the coast of Normandy. Thousands of troops died on D-Day, and many of their fellow soldiers still have those memories. Our Savannah Gato talked to a World War II veteran who, ha who, who fought during D-Day. Savannah. Cash Bradford Freeman is a man of few words, but the stories he shared are unforgettable, ranging from how he joined the Bear Troops to how he got to reunite with a boy he met during the war. When we went there, it was sad. We had Americans volunteering to leave. They were made you sick. 94-year-old Bradford Freeman remembers well serving in World War II, particularly his role in Normandy on D-Day. He recalls being dropped in a cow pasture and meeting a young boy and their exchange. We asked him if we had any candy, if, if we usually had a little candy. If we had candy, we give it to the children. And I, I don't know, that was a great thing we would do. Children and I asked him, I said, did you get any candy? And he says, candy. <laughs> Freeman says when a doctor came to offer help to him and his friend, he made sure his fellow soldier was taken care of first. He come over and went to cutting on my britches leg. I told him, get, no, I'm, I'm from the south. Boy, I'll free to death. Get over there and, <laughs> and take care of him. He was... He was crying because he was hurting. I wasn't, really. I, I wasn't working because it didn't hit no bone or nothing. Just got a leader into it. Memories from long ago that continue to make Freeman proud of his service. Several, several years later, Freeman went back to Europe to visit, and he told me how he met the same boy that he met in the cow pasture, and that little boy is now 81 years old.